everyone. We'll see if I complete the hard Sudoku today. And looking at the grid before I really get going, there's nothing in row 9. I've got 7 digits in the top 3 rows, 8 in the middle 3 rows, that's 15. Then another 8 in the bottom 3 rows, that's 23, but I got nothing in row 9. Interesting. Okay, I've got 4s in rows 1 and 2. 4 in row 3 must go in box 1, and there's only one space for it. Okay, in the middle three rows, I can repeat two and three. Uh, those twos are going to force a two there. These throw. I already have all my threes, darn it. Clever how they did that. Okay, in the bottom rows, seven, eight, one, four, five, six, five, nine. Okay, I can repeat a five. And one of these two. This cell is ruled out at the bottom corner of box eight because of that five. If I look by columns, eight six four three seven five seven one two. I can only repeat a seven, which must go in one of those. Uh, five eight two eight one four three. Okay, eight uh, must go on the right side of box two. There's only two places, but this is ruled out because of a given eight, so that must be an eight. Those two eights in turn are going to force one of these to be an eight. <coughs> Five, eight, two, eight, one, eight, four, three. Okay, I'm done with the leftmost column, the middle columns. What about the right columns? Four, six, three, nine, six, four, nine, five. Okay, I think I can place a four based on what this is saying in one of two places, and I. Those sixes, four is a six, and one on the right side, two places in box nine. That's ruled out because of that six, and therefore that one must be a six. Which in turn makes that six by these two in rows eight and nine. That one must be six. And I think that's as far as that goes. Now, as for nine. Uh, one of those two is a nine. Let's see, uh, in row three I have a rather lot of restricted digits. Eight, four, one, one, four, five, eight are already placed. But six can't go there because of that six. The only two spots in row three, this six rolls that one out, so that one must be six. Now, one, four, five, six, eight it says I need two, three, seven, and nine. And then row three is done. That's not three. That's not three or nine. That's anything, and that's not nine. Well, that's interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I put three in one of these two. But beyond that, I don't have much else to go with. But in box two, I've got four, five, six, eight placed. Two can't go in two of the four cells, so it must go there means it must go in one of these two. But I can't apply the same even odd logic to row one. Let's see, I've got one, four, five, six, seven, eight in row seven. I need two, three, and nine. This isn't it. Yeah, two, three, and nine. This is these three and nine. That must be two. These two are three and nine. Row seven is done, and that gives me five digits in box number seven. Three, five, six, seven, nine are placed. I need one, two, four, and eight. Well, neither of these can be one or two. So these must be one, two. 
these two must be four and eight. <coughs> <coughs> That gives me 1, 2, 4, 7, 8 placed in column 3. I need 3, 5, 6, and 9. This C3, 6, and 9, that must be 5. This can't be 3, so it must be 6 or 9. Whoops. Wrong mode. <coughs> That's 3, 6, or 9. Let's see, that 2 comes up here. This is 7. Uh, these are seven. That's also not two. Let's see, box nine, I've got two, four, five, six, nine placed. I need one, three, seven, and eight. But I'm not going to have much help. Oh, that's not seven either, that might help me. But the other cells are all 1, 3, 7, or 8, and I can't do anything about that. <coughs> hmm. Okay, column 7 has 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 9. I need 1, 5, and 8. That's any of the digits. Unfortunately, that cell is any of them also. 2, 3, 5, 6, 9 in row 4. It says I need 1, 4, 7, and 8. Okay, this is another 1, 7, 8 because it can't be 4. This is 1, 4, or 7 because it can't be 8. That's 1 or 8, it's not 4 or 7. This one looks like 1, 4, 7, but it can't be 8. Let's see, I've got 1, 4, 7, and 8 in box 1. I need 2, 3, 5, 6, and 9 to finish it out. This one sees 3, 5, and 6. That one also sees 3 and 5. Both of these see 6. I thought six, I thought six. All right, six must be in one of these two. I get nothing else out of it. Four, five, six, eight. I need one, two, three, seven, and nine. For box two. Neither of these are one and two. That's not seven. Not seven by the same reason. Okay, this is one, two, six, eight, nine here. Wait a minute. This can't be 8 by derivation. That's not 8, and these aren't 8, so that's an 8. One, two, six, eight. So these cells are three, four, five, seven, nine. That's not three, but could be anything else. It's annoying that that could be 
a four. Cells are not one, six, or eight, but that sees five and that sees three and four. Okay, and one, two is going to rule out that from being a two and that from being a two, so this isn't two. So this two and this two and these twos, well, this can't be two because of that, so that's a two. See, box three now has two, three, four, six, seven. I need one, five, eight, and nine. Oh, there's only one place for a nine. Yeah, that can't be nine, and that can't be nine all by given, so that's a nine. And now that must be a five, because neither of these can be, so that's a five, and by my quarter markings, that's an eight, which makes that one. This 9 means that's not 9, so that's a 3, which makes that 7. This is now not 1, 3, or 9. That, yeah, that must be 2, and that must be 1. And that has to be 4. Uh, 3 and 7 down here is going to make that 4. These are five or nine. But I should be able to do all this. Yep. Two is gonna make that nine. That's a five, and row one is done. Okay, row two may not be done, but at least that's a triple. Okay, one means that isn't one. Oh, this eight means that's not eight. That's not five. Okay, as expected, I've got one eight there. That was okay. Eight means these are not eight. That's not nine. Let's see, that's not seven or four or three, actually. <laughs> that's sorted. Okay, one, two, four, six, eight. So all the even digits are in. This can only be three, five, seven, or nine. It's facing five and nine. That's three or seven. So that has to be nine. Well, that could all. Oh, there's still nine here and in here. means this is not nine. Well, let's see, this one's almost done. What do I need? One, five, and seven there. <coughs> yeah, these are not one, two, three, five, or eight. Or not two, three, five, six, or eight. Let's see, 
those aren't three, six, or nine. Yeah, that's these four for the same reason that one does. Two and eight from that row. Two and eight from the row. And then one and five from the column. And then eight from that column. I think I can unwind this a little bit. Five can only go in one of these two spots. Could still be two, couldn't it? Oof, the eight could be oh, three could be down here. Mm. Let's see, five is definitely there. There, five is probably uh, definitely here. I have a feeling this is not five. Prove that. Mm. Mm. Let's see, call twos down to a triple, threes down to a triple. I don't like six being an offset pair like that. That's what happens when you end up with a triple there. Hmm. Let's see, I don't have anything else that's ornamented, do I? Unfortunately, and seven can go down there. And one could also bend. Let's see. Two's in one of two places. Five's in one of two places. And eight is in one of two places. Two, five, or eight. This almost says this can't be one or seven. Unfortunately, that leaves seven in one of three spots there. Hmm. Yeah. Is this two, five, or eight, and not one or seven? There's a trick I'm missing somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, there, there's a logical trick I'm missing someplace.
Yeah, the thing is that, well, I have to almost guess something. Three has to be in one of these two spots, and three has to be in one of these two spots. The only cell that makes both work is that one, so I'm going to argue that this cell is a three. Let's see where that takes me. That's a two. So this isn't two, and that's where that is. Three is going to make that seven. That's four. This is not seven. Neither is that. So this is one, three, eight. Four means this is not four. Oh, seven makes that three. That's not three. Now that must be three. Uh, row nine. That's a one. That's seven. These aren't one or seven. So these are one or seven either. That's a five. This is forced to be an eight. That's a one. Okay. Uh, this is one, and that's eight. No, this is seven. That's four. That's one. Row four is done. These are not one. This isn't four. Oh, one comes down here. Uh, two at the very bottom left. Not one. That's a one comes up here, that's six. The rest of this should be unwinding relatively easily. Six is going to unwind the two, three, six, triple, and row two. Uh, these cells are three, four, seven, nine. Well, that can't be three, so that's a nine. That's seven, that's four. Nine makes this three. Box seven is done. Seven, five. This is now forced to be a one. Nine to complete row six. That's a five. That's seven. This is six. Nine, three. Okay, that must be seven. Five, nine. Well, it took me a while to figure out that there was only one way that three could satisfy two places in box three and column nine, but once I figured that out, pretty much the rest of it was just unwinding in relatively straightforward fashion. Cool.